Welcome to MarcusG.TV. I am Chef Marcus Giuliano and I'm a chef on a mission. You can find all these videos at MarcusG.TV along with a lot of other ones. I talk about my passion about health and craft wine and craft beer and business stories and stuff like that. So, I've done a little series called The 50 Mistakes That I See Independent Restaurant Tours Make. I'm having a lot of fun doing this. I've made these mistakes, I've corrected myself. Um, I'm here to help. That's the bottom line. I'm here to help. Please email me if you have any questions on any of the videos uh, or any of the products or anything that uh, that I've mentioned in, in this whole series. Step number 37. Mistake number 37, actually. You guys don't read enough trade magazines and books. Look behind me. I have tons of books that go, you know, another several feet. Plus, I have tons of books at home. I love books. The funny thing is, if I'm planning like a Spanish menu or something, or this or that, I'll come here and know exactly where my books are. I'll grab them, I'll reference them, I'll get some ideas, or I'll flip through trade magazines. A lot of these trade magazines are free. If you're not going to read them, let your staff read them. Educate your staff. Hand them a food arts magazine. Hand them a nation's restaurant news. Hand them something. They will read it. Your chef will read it. Your bartender will read it. But you should be reading these magazines and see what's going on so you can ask your vendors, hey, I saw this new gin. Can, you know, are you going to bring this gin in? When can I buy this gin? I saw this new potato product. I saw this. I saw that. It's just like going to trade shows and deliver. It's a trade show delivered to your door. Okay? Take advantage of all those books, trade magazines, etc. Especially the websites now with the YouTube videos and everything. There's so much to learn. Keep learning, keep learning, keep improving. Thanks for watching. I'm Chef Marcus Giuliano. So I've been running my restaurant Aroma Time for 10 years in the Hudson Valley. And I used to be one of those restaurant owners that was married to my business, couldn't leave. The restaurant wouldn't be open if I wasn't here. I didn't trust anybody. I turned everything around. I've been here 10 full years, like I've said. I've defeated all the odds. I opened up this fine dining restaurant, upscale restaurant, in a small, depressed community. Um, I've learned a lot. I've made a lot of mistakes. And that's how I can confidently say, I can help you. I can switch that mindset. I can teach you uh, tips and techniques that I've learned by doing it myself and then masterminding with some of the top restaurateurs in the country and marketing geniuses. It's been a great 10-year run. I don't regret a single part of it. Now the thing is, I work on my business. I don't work my business, which is a totally different thing. I can teach you how to do that. It's so simple with the tips and tools and techniques. Um, owning a restaurant can be a lot of fun, and I want to show you how to have fun in your restaurant. So please, send me an email.